Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. It's a disgrace that we are busy saying our leader is the fifth among the top five in Africa. We are being told that he is governing according to the rule of law. We are perfect on human rights. But what is happening? Why you disrupt church proceedings to pick out the suspect? Who you have to establish the criminality against him? To break into his house in the manner we are seeing. It shows you that see, we have lost it completely. For me, I can't say more, but I can only tell you that see, my heart bleeds. I'm saying. Can we stop the hypocrisy? You know, Zambians should also stop being idle. They should wake up and speak to these things. Because today is Martin Mbaya. Yesterday it was the Honorable Linda. Next day it will be them. And I think uh, it's important that we see what's happening to others. I know that the bells will be tolling for us. Right. Right. Uh, I personally as Secretary General Patrick Frank came to confirm the harassment of uh, Mr. Martin Mbaya, who happens to be uh, basically an individual that is uh, 
uh, perceived to be an associate of uh, the president. We know the fact that uh, he's one of the, you know, the people that uh, you know, has known the Lungu family for a long time, way before President Lungu was president, during the time he was president, and even after. Um, the abominable practices of the DC to go and uh, pick up an individual while he is in a place of worship at Bethel Christian Center, Nyumbayanga, deserves condemnation. Condemnation in the sense that we know that that you know, act in itself was not only meant for the harassment of those who are associated to the former president, but also as a message to the church that there is, uh, uh, you know, according to this government, there is no such thing as sacred places. Everybody uh, has to receive a message of intimidation. What is even more worrying that uh, the presiding bishop of Bethel Ministries and Assemblies, where Bethel Christian Center belongs, is actually the executive director of EFZ, one that runs one of the critical, you know, institutions within the Board of Christ in Zambia. Are you telling me that without any regard whatsoever to the bishop, to the congregants, the law enforcement agencies would undertake such an operation on a Sunday when somebody is in church. That must be condemned. Two, we know that the UPND are so uptight and desperate around the political activities of the former president. And because they, their mindset is uh, criminal in nature, they think that the former president could be involved in some criminal activities uh, that uh, are used to propel their political, you know, his political career, when in fact not. When somebody is just naturally loved, people gravitate and are magnetized towards that particular person because of their good heart and also the legacy that they have left. Mr. Aka Indes Chichirema has this bubble that he has entered into of believing that the misfortune as a result of the failure to govern, that now people are beginning to directly tell him that we don't want you to continue as president. He thinks that it is sponsored and the people associated around him are the ones that possibly may be having either money or otherwise that is being used to sponsor these activities. When he went to West Western Province, it was his own miscalculation that landed him into the embarrassment he suffered there. It is on his own tribal mindset that led him to go there even when the people of Balosaland had said we have already invited a guest of honor, a guest of honor in Paramount Chief Chitimkulu to come and grace the occasion. For him, what he didn't want is this now what everybody is celebrating, the unity that this country is beginning to enjoy among those that were perceived, ethnic groupings that were perceived to be in you know, rivals or something. The cousinship that has been pronounced between the Easterners, uh, I mean between the, uh, the Western, Western province of Balosalan and the Bemba uh, law establishment, that is what he thought he could prevent. But people have already moved on. They have moved on above his tribal element, they have moved on above his uh, misgovernance, misgovernance uh, uh, that they have experienced and also the high cost of living that he has subjected Zambian people the deals that he has been cutting in the mines and other places. All we can say is that the harassment of Martin Mbaya is not even for him as an individual. He's basically wanting to attempt to provoke the former president. But as a party will not allow that you continue to try and intimidate the president. The pronouncement that Mariteta, um, Charles Milupi, and all those who are speaking in Mongo just reviews the mindset of Misaka in the and I want to say to the UPND, Patriotic Front is capable of defending itself. Patriotic Front is capable of rising to defend ourselves against the threats that you are, you know, uh, uh, issuing against the president and against the party. All we are interested in is to conduct ourselves in the interest of unity and peace for this country. And we will not be able to allow your provocation to rise to cause us to do things that will threaten the interests of this country. But don't take our humility and our tolerance for granted. Thank you very much and God bless. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. 
Alright, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.